FSB, Connecticut's number one local news. This is Channel 3 Eyewitness News at 4. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining us right now at 4 o'clock. First up for you today, a state in mourning. A lawmaker was killed in a crash on Route 9 in Middletown. Representative Quinton Williams, a Democrat from Middletown, was hit by a wrong way driver. Williams was liked by so many. And today, there's obviously an outpouring of emotion. Our Channel 3 chief political reporter, Susan Raff, is live at the state capitol, which is closed today because of the tragedy. Susan, what are you hearing about all this? Mark, the state capitol was closed today. So was the legislative office building, and both buildings will be closed tomorrow in honor of Representative Quentin Williams. This is such a terrible tragedy. In fact, Williams was in Hartford last night at the Bushnell at the governor's inaugural ball. He was celebrating with Republicans and Democrats to the start of the new legislative session. He was on his way home on Route 9 South. It was in Cromwell, we are told, that the crash actually occurred. He was hit head on by a wrong way driver. And really what makes this so very difficult is that he was liked by so many people here at the state capitol. And in fact, he was recently made chair of the labor committee and that committee was supposed to meet today. We are hearing from not only state lawmakers, but people from his community. He lived in Middletown. He was very well liked. He had served his community. We had a chance to talk to Dan Drew, the former Middletown mayor, about why Hugh, as he was affectionately called, was so important in his community. He was extraordinarily passionate about Middletown. Um, he was on the Planning and Zoning Commission. He ran the downtown business district. He was city treasurer for many years. He was a state representative. He was involved in um, a whole host of nonprofits, community events, his church. Uh, this is somebody who cared deeply every day for his community and for the people in it. Everyone seems to be deeply touched by this. The governor, Middletown leaders especially, and certainly his colleagues here at the state capitol. And coming up on Eyewitness News at 6, you'll hear from some of those in his community, including his own pastor and those closest to him, on what he meant to that particular community and about a special ceremony which is going to be held tomorrow in Middletown. For now, we are live at the state capitol in Hartford. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.